Meghan Markle launched a new website, American Riviera Orchard, last month, but she forgot to buy the UK domain name. While the official US version of the site remains intact, someone appears to have bought a UK domain website, which leads to a food bank website. The site ending in UK mysteriously leads to Trussell Trust landing page and then a fundraiser which carries a special message for the Princess of Wales. The Just Giving fundraiser features the message, not Meghan. Hope Meghan wouldn't mind. Thoughts with Catherine. The fundraising page had received £56 as of Thursday morning, with the target being a 1000 The money will go towards the Trussell Trust that works to stop UK hunger and poverty. It's understood the users not affiliated with the charity. Meghan Markle soft launched the latest business venture lifestyle brand American Riviera Orchard last month. The brand has an Instagram page for it which showcases the new logo and linked to the .com website, which still only features a waiting list. American Riviera Orchard's hard launch has not been announced yet, however earlier this week its first product, Strawberry Jam, was sent to 50 influencers to taste test ahead of the launch. Megan will be selling through a brand a wide range of products including household goods, cookware, pet products, gardening tools, beverages, food and condiments. A while back, Lady Colin Campbell said that she bought some domain names in the UK for Megan's Arrow Venture. Could she be the person who purchased the domain rights? Earlier this week, Megan's friends started popping up on social media, thanking her for the products that she'd sent to them. Megan reportedly sent out 50 strawberry jams. But to die for, Daily's Kinsey Schofield has been left far from impressed, telling Daily Express, I think the idea of a big DIY jam launch with peeling labels is thoroughly disappointing. When you acknowledge the fact that Harry and Meghan have had very little success since stepping back from the British royal family. It appears that so far Meghan's relying on her friends to get the word out on the first product from a hotly anticipated new lifestyle brand. Schofield finds the entire venture problematic and said, after years of international media debating whether or not the suit star would run for president, the most powerful position in the world, Meghan is finally campaigning to promote a homemade preserve. The royal expert sees this as wasted potential, and it's all because of ego too that Harry and Meghan put themselves before the institution. According to Schofield, the Sussexes would be heroes today if they'd been more patient and more respectful. Besides, PR guru Mark Bukowski has labelled the strategy as weird. Commenting on the look of the item, PR guru Mark Bukowski told the Times, it's either hubris or else a very weird strategy. What's in it? What does it taste like? There's no story there, nothing on the back, just a label, and even that looks like it's peeling off. The PR expert further questioned how involved Megan is in making the produce. He said, It's a clear karaoke of what a father-in-law has been doing for a couple of decades with great success. But with far less authenticity, do we really think that Megan's been stirring the jam pan herself?